And coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Four years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Now for the introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A Muay Thai kickboxer holding a professional record of 17 wins, no losses, and one draw. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Liverpool, England, Darren Till. And now, fighting out of the red corner. A wrestler holding a professional record of 14 wins, one loss. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Fort Lauderdale, Florida, USA. Colby Chaos! Colby Chaos! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. Mario Yamasaki draws the assignment here. Here we go, first one, you ready? You ready? Fight now, the southpaw stance. And he connects there, Joe. with that huge kick. That one hurt. That's a nice clean shot. Both guys have proved to be dangerous in the opening seconds of this fight. Look at that, he's timing that jab. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now, that can't feel good. Look at that, nice. Blocking all the shots coming towards his head. Just missed with the left there. Punishing kick there. Nice defense there. Huge block. Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Eats a, ni a nice right hand. Excellent defense here. Really good job blocking all those shots coming at his head. Ooh. Every shot he throws, he's looking to KO you. Clips him with the left hand. Push kick there to the body. Oh, big shot. Landing a good series of strikes here. Oh! This could be it right here. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Oh! Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Big elbow. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Body shot, shot. Body. And really starting to make these shots count. A little bit uneventful. Sweet reversal. Another shot lands upstairs. Once again establishing the jab here. Very good job of timing these punches. Wow! Oh. This could be it. He is up, but man, is he hurt. A finish could come here at any time. Oh, right huge hand. right hand. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Excellent posture. 10 seconds to go in round one. Couple hammers fish there for good measure. Round two straight ahead. No, no, no. Right, take a seat. Deep breath in. Breathe, breathe. All right, you with me? Good. All right, your takedowns were great that round. I want. All right, let's take a look at some of the action here. Here's a perfect kick to the body. And here, a perfectly placed punch results in a knockdown. Here we see a devastating punch that results in a knockdown. 
Brittany Palmer is in the building. Second round here. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. The next there with the punch. That cut on his cheek is really starting to get nasty. They could stop this fight. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Oh. Oh. He's got him hurt here. Oh, very nice. Strike to the body here is really starting to he, hurt him. Oh. he is clearly in big, big trouble. Man. Nasty combinations here. Oh, straight right. Big oh, power in that hook. Shot, that oh. one appeared to stun him. He's in big, big trouble here. Big body, body shot. shot there. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly, yeah, oh. looks a little wobbly on his feet. That hurt him. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, very nice. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Landed a gigantic kick for the knockout. Yeah, Joe, this fight was over as soon as that kick made contact. And you want to credit the offense and not denigrate the defense, but he did not get the guard up. And against this type of striker, you are absolutely playing with poison. So a near-perfect kick spells the end of this one here tonight. And here we see it again. I mean, just stiff. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. We set it inside the Octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at two minutes, 37 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Kobe. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends after this monumental victory here under the bright lights tonight. See what you thinking about by associates I've been scarred, fought and lost with the wall.